好，二零二三年第五、第六條 MC 咧就同下面呢幅圖有關係嘅，佢就顯示咗一個細胞嘅細胞周期嘅三個階段，一、二、三啦。然後啦，題目就問翻下面 A、B、C、D 四句啦，邊一句能夠正確描述到喺個細胞周期嘅不同事件、哦？究竟佢係邊一個階段發生嘅咧？咁呢個題目啦，就係考翻我哋啦，究竟分唔分得清一二三係乜嘢階段打咩階段先？咁你見到題目嗰幅圖咧，同我哋書幅圖係一模一樣，只不過啦，就順時針領一領幅圖俾你哋睇一睇啫。咁啊，所以啦，第三個階段咧就係間期，就係、是、一個細胞喺一次細胞分裂同埋下一次嘅細胞分裂之間嚟嘅階段嚟嘅。而間期咧係佔咗一個細胞周期入面大約九成嘅時間嘅，然後啦就去到核分裂啦，跟住啦就去到包質分裂啦。當我哋分辨咗階段一二三係乜嘢之後咧，我哋就要去諗下啦，究竟係階段一二三發生咗啲乜嘢嘅細胞活動咧？究竟發生了什麼事咧？而家我哋就嚟做一擊破咯。A 咧佢就講啦。細胞質咧就喺 stage 一嘅時候咧就係、是、一分為二就分咗一半半喎、哦。咁其實第一步驟咧就係、是、核分裂。喺核分裂嘅階段啦，又點會去將我哋嘅細胞質分開咧？所以啦，實質唔係 stage one，、哦、而係 stage two，、哦、所以 A 啦就錯咗啦。跟住到 B 咧，佢就講啦，喺 stage two 嘅時候咧，一個姊妹染色單體又會分開、哦。stage two 咧就係、是、包質分裂，包質分裂啦，又點會分開我哋嘅染色單體咧？所以啦 ，stage two 又係錯咯，應該係 stage one 先啱喎，所以 B 咧又錯咗啦。跟住啦就去到 C 啦，佢就話喺 stage three 嘅時候咧，間期咧個細胞就會製造多咗嘅細胞器喎。啊，咁呢句咧係正確嘅喎，咁啊因為啦喺間期嘅時候咧個細胞係非常之活躍嘅狀態，係有好多唔同類型嘅生化反應咧係喺度發生緊嘅。就例如啦，我哋個細胞係成長緊啦，吸收養分啦，製造多啲細胞器啦，因為個細胞。都要進行佢嘅工作噶嘛，系咪？咁所以啦 ，C 咧就已經係答案咯。當然啦，有啲體育精神睇埋 D 嗰句咯。D 佢就話啦，喺第三個階段嘅時候咧，嗰啲染色質咧就會將自己濃縮成為染色體，望起上嚟似似地。但係呢句説話都係錯，係因為啦，好多同學咧就搞亂咗啊。喺間期做緊嘅時候咧，係 DNA 嘅複製，即係話當個細胞將要進行細胞分裂之前。就係、是、複製嗰個 DNA， 但係呢一句佢唔係講複製 DNA， 佢係講緊染色質。濃縮成為染色體，佢並唔係喺間期度發生，而係喺核分裂嘅時候發生。但係核分裂唔係話將個染色體分開咩 ？No no no， 咁係因為啦，核分裂仲有一個階段叫做前期啊嘛，前期就係講緊染色質濃縮成為染色體啦，所以啲咧都係錯。咁你見到今次呢條題目咧，就宏觀啲去睇嘅，睇間期啦。核分裂啦，同埋包質分裂嘅，咁下次啦又可以問問翻你 ，prophase、metaphase、anaphase、telophase 嘅階段究竟發生緊啲咩事啊？咁係可以啦。Two, two, three, question five and six refer to this diagram, which shows the three stages of a cell cycle. So you can see that stage one, two, and three. And then the question asks us about that. Which of the following correctly describe the events in the cell cycle? So for this question, the first concept checking is about the identification of the stage one, two, three in the cell cycle. So it's just like that for the good practice for the labeling of the cells or structure A, B, C. We have the name of the structure, and for this diagram, we need to identify. The stages of the cell cycle. So you can see this diagram in the question is just the same as the diagram in the textbook. So you can see that for stage three, it is the interface. Interface is the stage between two successive cell division, and it makes up about ninety percent of the time in a cell cycle. And then stage one, nuclear division. Stage two, cytoplasmic division. So, and you see, so after we identify stage one, two, three, and then we need to recall the cell activities taking place in the stages one, two, three. Okay, so let's take a look at the answer one by one. Option A: the cytoplasm is half in stage one. In stage one, it is the nuclear division. Surely, it is not the answer. It should be the stage two cytoplasmic division, right? And then for part B, sister chromatid separate. In the stage two, it's also the wrong concept because stage two is the cytoplasmic division. It should be the chromosome is being halved. Therefore, this answer is also wrong. It should be in stage one nuclear division. And then option C, 
the cell synthesize more organelles in stage 3? It is the correct answer. Because in the interface, the cell is very active. They absorb the nutrients to grow up for the cell enlargement, make it bigger. As well, it synthesizes more organelles, new organelles for the normal function. Meanwhile, the synthesis of more new organelles is the way to prepare for the cell division. And then for part D, the chromatin condensed to form the chromosome in stage 3 is also the wrong concept. But some students may mix it up with the DNA replication during interphase. Yes, when the cell is just about to do the cell division, they need to do the DNA replication. But it doesn't mean that chromatin will condense at this stage. So the chromatin will condense to form chromosome at which stage it should be the stage number one nuclear division but you may ask that no 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 mr leung nuclear division is talking about the separation of the nucleus right yes i agree with you but one of the stage is called prophase so during prophase chromosome shortened and thickened and it is the process for the chromatin condensed to form the chromosome so that's why the answer is c